What's up, y'all? So today I'm coming to y'all with a little story time. As you can tell by the title, you know what I'm gonna talk about. So this is for y'all doing y'all research, for y'all that have it, for y'all that are probably in the same situation as me. I was just gonna let y'all know that what happened with me and what I did. I feel like this is not a common thing. I don't hear about people getting their necks put on, stuck in their arm. Just got done doing another video, so don't mind all this stuff over here. This is from my Ulta haul, and if you haven't seen that video, go check it out. If you're interested in figuring out what happened to me and my story, just stay tuned. right after I graduated high school because I was on my way to college and I was like I cannot get pregnant in college I need to be on birth control so I told my mom to put me on birth control and that's how it all started and it worked There's, I've heard of other girls getting pregnant like on it but that was like on the internet I've never met anyone personally that was on this and they have gotten pregnant by it but if it happens, it happens, you know what I'm saying? Two years go by, it's still working, I'm fine. And I recommended it to somebody and I went with her to go get it. And her doctor told her to feel her arm before she left and made sure that she felt the birth control on the surface of her skin, which is where it's supposed to be. I'm over here trying to feel mine and I could never feel mine. Like from the day I got it, I have never felt it. I went to my doctor to see if she could feel it and she told me she felt it and I still couldn't feel it. The year that I was supposed to get it out comes by which was June 22nd, 2018 and we have a different insurance by the time the year that I'm supposed to get it changed comes by. So now I'm going to completely different people that didn't he, don't even know the people that put it in i scheduled the appointment for like maybe like a month after i was supposed to really get it out he tells me that he can't even feel it so he wants to make, make sure it's still there so he gets an x-ray i leave for a couple months go back to school i come back again like three months later someone that's not professional enough or have enough medical information you know they don't have enough they're like a nurse assistant are you even qualified to do this yeah but i've never done one this deep okay so you're not going to do mine make another appointment with someone more professional she recommends me to a surgeon i went to the surgeon two weeks ago and basically what happened is that they sent him my x-rays he basically says that he is not going to promise that he's going to take it out because he doesn't know if he can take it out. He'll just try. That's what he's. That's what he told me. He's going to try to take it out. But he doesn't want to promise and then he can't find it. And I feel him on that, but it was just like, bro, I'm so tired of going to these appointments. So I went to the procedure room. It was not an OR. This was like a mini procedure under local anesthesia. He cut probably like two inches and he was searching for it and basically my birth control was launched in my biceps i was so happy he got it out after care was he basically stitched up my arm and glued it back up like he put glue on the surface but he stitched the inside this has been fine it's been healing up the glue is peeling off by itself i'll be taking pain medicine twice the whole time it's not that bad basically he told me that he's never even seen a birth control launched in somebody's muscle like a foreign object in somebody's muscle with that story i'm not telling y'all don't get it learn from my mistake i guess um do your research um on stuff i was just telling y'all what happened to me thank y'all for watching like and subscribe Techno music.